Our next question comes from a viewer named Tom. Curious about whether the strong winds we've seen lately are considered Chinook winds. He was wondering what makes a Chinook wind different. So we asked meteorologist Kylie Burse. Today's wind is actually considered a Bora wind because it's coming from a more northerly direction. Bora wind has more to do with pressure systems where Chinook winds happen because of mountainous terrain. Here in Colorado, we've got those gorgeous east facing foothills. So when we have a wind that comes straight in from the west, those winds race down the side. Here's what happens when the wind goes down a mountain, the air warms and loses moisture. On average, air warms about five and a half degrees for every thousand feet. Because they're so warm, sometimes they're called snow eaters. They can melt a foot of snow on the ground in just one day. If there isn't any snow to melt, they can dry out vegetation, and that's why they're especially dangerous when it comes to fire danger. Why do we call them Chinook winds? Well, they're actually named for the Native American people who live in the Pacific Northwest where the air mass originates. And we're not the only one with wind like this. You've probably heard of the Santa Ana winds in California during fire season, and in Switzerland, when wind goes down the Alps, it's called the fun winds. Fun winds. All right, put our next team to work answering your nagging questions about Colorado, anything about it, or we settle a bet between you and somebody you know. We'll get the answer. Our contact information never changes. You know how to find us.